Tonight, the shutdown effects are rippling into the sports world. FC Dallas soccer players are missing training camp because of some visa delays. Teresa Woodard explains the growing problems. It is the most global sport. Players from four continents make up FC Dallas's preseason roster. On the third day of training camp, seven international players have not even made it to America. Everywhere from Haiti to uh, Togo to, to Ghana to uh, Honduras. Visa processing is delayed, likely because of the longest government shutdown in American history. Well, I was supposed to um, get here on January 8th, but since my visa appointment got pushed that, uh, back to January 16, I couldn't get back till last night. Ima Tumasi began traveling between Ghana and the U.S. when he started high school. In seven years of regular back and forth visits, he's never had this much trouble. No, nope, no, nope, it's not, not fun at all, <laughs> especially coming back from Ghana where it's always warm. Helping players adapt to cooler weather, a new city, new coaches, new teammates, is much of what the early days of training camp are for. The social uh, part of this is just as important as any type of tactical work or technical work. This week is very important for us to get the aerobic uh, aspect of our game back and just get our heart rate back up and the fitness back a little bit. So it's gonna it's gonna take a little bit more for them to adjust because just because they're not here right now. And you're calling the embassies and you're calling the lo the lawyers, the immigration and. A nuisance is how the director of soccer operations describes these delays. Try to put in the, the bigger perspective that uh, a lot of people are, are going through some tough times right now. He knows a resolution will come. He just wonders when. Teresa Woodard, Channel 8 News.